Hey family, it's the Mobile Home Diva, and in today's video, I am going to be touring the single wide. It is the Brunswick. It's out here at Wayne Fryer Homes in Byron, Georgia, and it's absolutely beautiful. Let's get into the video. Okay, family, again, this is the Brunswick. It is a single wide home. It's located at Wayne Fryer Homes in Byron, Georgia. This is the front of the single wide. Wanted to give you a look at the front as well as the back. As with most uh, manufactured home dealerships, it's right on the side of the road. As a matter of fact, Highway 75 runs in front of it. So it was super, super loud, but this is the back and you've seen the front. And I just wanted to make sure that you knew what the exterior looked like. So now let's go on the inside. All right, this is the runs with you guys it is a single wide home and i love it i absolutely love it so i'm gonna turn around here and let you see where we entered this is the living room space this living room is a nice size living room already love the transom windows up above where i would put my couch area you have this entertainment center here on this wall by the front door. You can put a 65 inch TV up there if you choose. You've got your plug and outlets already installed for your cable and internet, as well as your uh, TV. You've got space down here for storage. Lovely, 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 lovely. Again, that's the front door. Now behind the front door, the secondary, uh, is one of the this is a two bedroom two bath so you have one bedroom on one side of the house and another bedroom on the other side we'll get into that in a minute but let's take a look at this living room you've got a ceiling fan in there nice size space vents in the ceiling like what's not to love about this home on around into the kitchen you've got this large island you could probably depending on how they're made put three stools. Now your sink is also in the island, but you've got plenty of space over here uh, for prepping uh, and things of that nature. Look at all the storage that you have over here on this wall. It's got a side-by-side -side refrigerator, so you've got lots of space for your food needs, lots of cabinet space over here. Love it. You've got six sections that you can put your pantry items. You also have your dishwasher and you have cabinet space over here. They made the island white and the rest of the kitchen has dark cabinets, always a nice contrast. Then you've got all of this cabinet space over here by the, by the uh, stove. So really, really lovely, really lovely. Love that you can put your spices, and all the things that you'll need to cook, your pots and pans over here, your utensils, you've got drawers over there. So really nice. So that is the kitchen. And then your living room. All right, let's check out one of the bedrooms. Behind this door, You've got a secondary bedroom. You've got your bathroom here. You've got a single vanity mirror and vanity lights up there. And then you've got your built-in tub and shower over there. Really nice. And then this is your secondary bedroom. You've got all of the space in here. 
as your bedroom. This would, if it's just you, would serve as a nice office or multi-purpose room. Um, I would make it an office if it was just me. You got this closet space in here. I would even bring the shelving around so I would have more space to hang stuff. But you've got all of that space for your storage needs or for whoever's room this is for their clothes. So this is the secondary, secondary bedroom, you guys. Really nice. And again, it's next to the bathroom. So your company that's here and also whoever's room this is has uh, plenty of space for their bathroom needs. Really nice. Through the kitchen, we'll take a look at the utility room and the master. If you want it, in front of this sliding glass door, you can put a small table, maybe a table and two chairs if you want it. If it was just me, I don't know. It would be nice to sit at the table and look outside in the mornings while I drink coffee, but I could probably do that from the island. But you know, it's really up to you. You could put the table here in the middle and just have two chairs or a small table with four chairs, whatever you decide. On around here, you have your laundry room. So it's down this hall, kind of out of the way, which is always nice. So if you're doing laundry and you have company, they don't have to see your mess. Your washer and dryer go here and you have space up top for your storage needs. Really nice. So again, that's, that's tucked away down that hallway, so really nice. I don't know if I mentioned it, but you've got lots of uh, electric plugs in here for whatever your needs. You could even put a small deep freezer in this space. Lots of uh, outlets around the stove, super nice. Let's look at the master. Got a nice master here. Nice space for your master, all of this is master bedroom. Those cabinets actually go in the kitchen, but all of this space is master bedroom. You've got this large window here, and then in your master, you also have those transom windows up top. Really love that. A lot of space and a lot of light in here. You have a separate master closet. It's a walk-in closet. That's your water heater behind that odd door kind of sort of door, but that's where your water heater is. All of this is master closet, you guys. Next to the master closet is your master bath. You have this huge, huge shower. It has a real people bench on the inside. You've got rain shower, shower head, and I love the tile in here. You also have this vanity. It has one sink, but you have lots of sp countertop space, three drawers, lots of cabinet space, as well as the cutout in the bottom. I would probably roll towels and put those down there, have all my personal items tucked away behind doors. And you have that transom window up there, so you have natural light coming in. It also has pendant lighting, not pendant lighting, I'm sorry. Uh, what do you call that light? The can light in this bathroom, so really nice. Really nice. All right, this is the Brunswick. It's out here at Wayne Fire Homes. I don't think I mentioned the can lights in the kitchen. I was looking for them after I saw the ones in the bathroom. This home is at Wayne Fryer Homes in Byron, Georgia. They typically sell live oak homes. This is the Brunswick. It's a single wide, you guys. Two bedroom, two bath. If you're interested in the price or any specifications about this home, 
then you'll have to contact the dealership as they don't post prices since they fluctuate so much these days. But all the information to the wonderful salespeople at Wayne Fryer Homes of Byron, Georgia will be in the description box below. Thanks so much for watching. Have a good day.